Hey guys, it's Games here, and welcome back to the video. So today we have icon moments. So let's take a look at what's gone on. So pretty much, I've headed over to uh, this website here, which I'll put the link in the description for. It is the official uh, icon moments player pictures. So we know icon moments are coming soon. They're gonna be they're gonna be in the game probably this Friday, if not next Friday. Last. Uh, FIFA, I think they were introduced with uh, Winter Refresh cards, so maybe we'll be getting that either this Friday or the Friday after, or maybe not at all, because you know EA have kind of gone a little bit off um, off the schedule, obviously due to the late release of the game from uh, COVID. But um, yeah, pretty much this website is is pretty insane because it's it's gone through and got all of the uh, you know new new icon moments so I'm not going to go through them all but I'm going to go through like a few of them um, like they might stand out to you obviously feel free to have a look at uh, in the description uh, for the link and you can check them out for yourself and um, you can you can download them and whatever so um, you can obviously use them for whatever you want to use them for really make your own cards print them out whatever so um, obviously uh, they're, they're not all the same as last year some are different some are better some are worse so uh, we'll take a look so starting off one of the better ones is at the top here Bastian Schweinsteiger kissing the World Cup I think that's that, that's so cool got Ronaldinho you'll have to tell me in the comments as well because I haven't got time to work, work out all of them but where where are these cards um, these images taken from really so um, is Ronaldinho is uh, Barca days or what and then that uh, Drogba I, I don't I don't know if that's Chelsea or what um I'll have to find out. Obviously, Rui Costa, pretty cool one. I didn't realise his hair was like that. Um, maybe that's just from this uh, moment in time. Got David Beckham with no hair there. Um, Inzaghi screaming. Zidane, is that the World Cup when he's uh, headbutted someone? I don't know. You tell me. Shevchenko looks like... I don't know for sure who uh, everyone's played out, but is that an Inter Milan or an AC Milan? Did he play for one of them? I don't know. Uh, could be wrong. Ian Wright is one of my uh, my favourites. That's a crazy uh, dynamic image. That's uh, pretty cool. Matei is probably one of the worst ones. Uh, Suka is not great. Gerard is pretty cool. Liverpool fans will be loving that one. Another class one, Bobby Moore. I'm not sure what that is. Is that the European Cup? Um, I could really be wrong. Is that with England? I'm not sure. Uh, is that uh, with his club? West Ham, I think he played for. Uh, Man U. Uh, yeah, I'm going to get half of these wrong. So you've got to tell me in, just in the comments. But... Um, this story's all right. Ronaldo's cool just because he's he's you know he's Ronaldo and he's smiling. Pele looking back. Uh, um, I don't know what. <laughs> um, Skulls, interesting one. Not too good. Seedorf quite good. Uh, Desai's a bit, but you know, Schmeichel's not great. Maradona's a good one. Um, I'll take a look at FIFA 20 ones in a sec, only because I want to compare the ratings and stuff. But um, yeah, Maradona's not a bad one. Uh, we've got Nesta there's all right. Carlos is okay. Puskas. Decent one. I like I like what he's wearing, like an old school football top. Roy Keener is not in Forest days. I have seen that one floating about on Twitter. Um, Crespo's all right. Sanchez, okay. Um, Nakata, that's one you don't want to get out of your icon moment pack um, when that comes about. Obviously, Yashin's always a cool one. Huller is just, he's Huller, isn't he? So that's a class one. I like Cantona's with the collar up, you know, it's classic. Um, Sol Campbell, bit of a bit of a cool one. Cruyff, he's Cruyff. Any of the big icons, it doesn't matter what their photo is, they're going to be sick, aren't they? So Baggio's a cool one, you know, the celebration. Fernando Torres, is that Liverpool or Chelsea days? I'm not too sure. Vieira is Arsenal closer. Alberto, Ian Rush, a Welsh fan like me, I like that. Liverpool fans are probably like that. Real Ferdinand, uh, it's obviously his Man U days. Uh, Lampard, it's Chelsea. It's, there's there's loads of cool ones. I don't I don't want to go through them all, you know. Eusebio's there. Um, Gattuso, who's that? Philip Lahm, obviously a new icon. Garincha with it. That looks like a base layer, but it might even be the, the his usual top. There's Petacek, one of the better ones. I've had a look through some of them. But literally, guys, you scroll down. Hernandez is cool with his long hair. Uh, Perlo, absolutely screaming. Eto's a good one. But literally... I think there's 80. I'm pretty sure there's 80 on here. Um, it might say at the top. Uh, no, it doesn't. Uh, yeah, but it, you can have a look for yourself, guys. Um, I, I've got to go with Schweinsteiger as my favourite. Kissing the World Cup, something that not everyone can do. Not all players will ever get to. So, um, yeah, it's pretty pretty insane one. But if we go over to Footbin here, 
Um, this is uh, FIFA 20 players, so don't get confused now. These these aren't the FIFA 21 ratings, but I want to just show you, take a look at... Um, We'll take Maradona for the starters. So he's 99 rated. Obviously, you can't go higher than that. But he was a 97 his prime. So he's gone up two ratings there. Um, I don't know what, what the kind of going rate is. If we go for Pele here. Oh, um, there we go. Uh, he's gone up one rating from 98 to 99. Obviously, he couldn't have gone up two because he'd take him to 100. So let's take someone lower down. Go for Maldini. He was a 94, gone up to a 95. So it's kind of about that one to two range. I'm not sure if there's anyone who went up three. Um, let's go for Puyol, 92 to 94, there's another 2 there. Um, so we don't know ratings for sure yet, but we do know that these cards are going to be insane. They always are, the prime moments are a big step up. If you look at that there, 92 gigs had 80 shooting, it went up 6 shooting, 4 pace, well, actually it shows you there, doesn't it? One, uh, 1 passing, 2 dribbling, 1 defending, 1 physical. The boosts are incredible, and that's why they're obviously the best ever versions of these cards. It's it's honestly insane. So it's kind of it's kind of scary to think that some people be having these in their teams. Obviously, they're gonna do it. Look at that plus six shooting again. They're gonna do a pack at some point, probably towards the end of team of the season or something. They'll do a prime icon moment, or maybe even after team of the season. But you should be ready for that. But even before that, they're gonna be in packs. One of you guys watching this will pack one. It's just it's as simple as. But um, it's kind it is kind of scary. But yeah, like I said. In the description is the icon moment images. Uh, this link here. Obviously, if you go to Footbin, just goes players, uh, foot twenty, foot twenty players. If you want to take a look at the old ones, if you've forgotten like me, literally, I um, I kind of stopped playing after team of season, so I wasn't into the like icon moment packs and stuff. Probably will be this year with a bit of lockdown, uh, not much else to do. But yeah, that's been a bit of a kind of like a um. I don't know, like an informative video maybe, something something new, some content to show you. Um, but uh, yeah, hopefully you guys are excited for Icon Moments, potentially this Friday, uh, if not Icon Swaps probably, or both, or Icon Moments next Friday. So um, yeah, if you enjoyed it, please hit thumbs up and subscribe already. Peace.